Hey guys, I'm Mega G Wolf, and welcome back to the Sonic Hack Showcase. Today we're continuing to show off some Sonic Hacking Contest entries of 2020. Now this one is very unique. I love the implementation of this, and it is something I would never have thought of. And you can see my mouse cursor, maybe that gives it away, but uh, click on Sonic. So this is Sonic point and click, or as, whoops, I didn't actually get a chance to click on him. Uh, as it says in the uh, the little like window, it says Sonic one, but you can click on everything. And that's true. We can click on us and we can right click to jump. We can even use the mouse to collect rings or pick up objects. We can change his direction. No, you can't go towards me, my friend. And it's just, everything is interactable. It's great. Boo, 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 boo. <laughs> I, I love this so much. It's really, really awesome. And uh, I thought there was a... Oh, yeah, boing. There we go. I can fling the mouse up. It even reacts to things. That's like why I feel like this is super impressive. Do, 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 do. Whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> it's really cool. One of the things you can also do with monitors um, is you can smash them on the ground. What? Smash. Okay, bye. But you can smash them on the ground. Okay, I guess that counted. Nice to know it hit something. It's so cool, though. I love this. And uh, I think if we didn't have the invincibility, so like, like having the mouse on the spikes would actually hurt. Remember right? Yeah. Ah, and it becomes like unusable for a while. So you can actually control this. Still, I'm still controlling this with a controller, like left and right. But right click being jump means that you can have your hand on your controller and you can like still play this with, uh... oh, there it goes. Ha, eh, ha, eh. There we go. And you can still, so basically you can like dual wield basically and it won't feel too weird. Ha, get around there. Oh, I guess not. Eh, eh, boy. I like bounce, it's weird. Can I spin dash in this? Okay, no, it's still Sonic 1. I don't know, some people add those those kind of features into something like this, but I guess not in this case. Woo! Oh yeah, let's do this. This will probably be really good. Ha! Get all the rings, all the rings, yeah! Yeah, all of them. I don't actually remember what the special stage is like for this. Okay, I can't hit those. I can just destroy those. But then again, do I want to use the special sage, or do I want to uh, do the fun thing you can do with the end ring? That's the thing I'm wondering about. Ho! Oh! I don't know what actually made that one get destroyed, but okay. Yeah, let's actually go in there, and then we'll get the points. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> it's so fun to just fuck with things with the mouse. It's, it's great. I love this. It like, that's it. That's all it is. But it's really well done. Oh, yeah, that's right. You control with the... Oh, God. Like, ultimate control. Is it worthwhile? You can do some sick 360 no-scopes. Uh, 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 uh. There we go. <laughs> Arguably really easy. And probably super easy to mess up, too. But there is something else you can do with those. I'm trying to, like, click everything, including like title screens and stuff because ne I've not I don't think I've experimented with absolutely everything that you can click I assume these just shoot more yeah okay boing 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 <laughs> get out my way <laughs> hey -ah! thank you for the shield oh, I can't click those that's fine oh wait no we need to interact with the wall ah you just yeah you're just uh, back and forth push this out of the way I think I can, yeah, I can just destroy it. Thank you. Woo. Pow. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, and that one's, what? Well, it's destroyed. So just moving it and going off screen counts as destroying it, but doesn't actually destroy it, I guess. Huh? Oh, no. No way, wait, wait, We gotta, we gotta get, wait, can I just look up and do it actually? Yeah. Yeah, let me take that. <laughs> yeah! 
I love this. It's so good. So if I like carry this around with me, is it gonna get used eventually? Ah, fuck. Oh no, if only I had invincibility. Dang it, I should have used that way sooner. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to... Damn, oh well. I just realized I've uh, wasted my opportunity to show you what the, uh, what the old special stage ring does. It basically explodes into a bunch of rings. So, like you can sacrifice it to just get a ton of rings if you want to. Boy, 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 boy. Boo! <laughs> I think, if I remember right, I can't hurt Robotnik with the cursor, but I can do something with him. And I'm looking forward to being able to do that. Oh, yes. So the other thing is that it will, um, it will, eh. There we go. It will also trigger the things to fall, so you have to be careful. There is... I like that there are some downsides to having this kind of flexibility, so you kind of have to worry about where your mouse is. Pow, 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 pow. That's actually kind of neat. I do like the trade-off there, even though the... Really, there's no pros or cons of this. It's just... You want to fuck around with the mouse while you play Sonic 1. That's basically all it is. But, I can appreciate this nonetheless. Ow. Hurt my mouse cursor. Ow again. Ow again. E. Ha ha ha. Oh, hey, whoa. Hey, ho. Hey. <laughs> so much fun to just fling these things around. Hell yeah. Okay, I can't go through them normally. I did wonder if it was just like limited now all of a sudden. Hey, ah. Wait, I need that invincibility. Here we go. Not really, I don't need it. Because, <clears throat> not that he's going to be able to do much to me anyway. Because I've got him by the balls. Oh, no, wait, no, I've got him by the balls, as you can see. Ha ha! As long as you're on the, as long as you're on the ball. The only problem is the camera moving, kind of. You have to adjust for the camera movements, so. Eh! <laughs> I, I have not gone through this game and experimented with all the things that this thing can, like, mess with. And I really kind of want to one day. And highly recommend that you try this out to be able to get the full point and click experience. <laughs> can I actually, like, click this? I can. I get stuck. Oh, and there I go. Hell yeah. I love this. It's so creative. It's such an interesting way to use the... the, the everything i guess hardware because this i didn't even realize there was a mega drive mouse like i knew there was one for the super nintendo i was not aware of one for uh for the mega drive which is kind of interesting what does you do oh it just explodes you okay so it's just really interesting to see all these things eh. ah oh wow i actually still hurt him i'm surprised can i interact with the fireball oh okay it just hurts so I can click it, and get it gets rid of it, but it just hurts me. That's fine. Okay, am I going to be able to interact with these? Ah, yeah, you see? Got to be careful with the mouse on that one. Could actually cause some issues. No, no. Oh, hey, it's stuck. <laughs> you could probably use some fun stuff like that, too. Just, like, get it stuck and stuff. Oh, there it goes. Hey, it still counts. Okay, got to make sure I get the mouse out of the way. Ah! You could probably do some, like... Oh! Oh, okay. You could probably do some, like, glitches, too. Like... I don't think, I don't think this is gonna work. Considering it's not, like... Yeah, it's not staying on that now. Is there... Oh! Oh, fire! Oh, my goodness. Uh... Eh. Yeah, it's probably, like, some funky thing you can do with this, but... Yeah! There we go. Can I do anything with you? Nope. I think I can press the button when I get to that. I don't remember if I can also, like, hold back the lava in the second act. That'd be pretty funny. Ow. Let me just see. Can I, can I click on... Oh, I can click on that. Oh boy, it's gonna be risky. Ah! Ha ha! <laughs> there we go. Alright, so yeah. I mean, that's it. That's... That's... Point and click. It's 
really fascinating. And I kind of wouldn't mind going through the game like this at some point. Maybe I'll do it on a live stream or something. But highly recommend it. Really interesting. Um, there's a bit of setting up you need to do. So if you use like Kager Fusion, which is what I use, you can set up the second port to have the mouse and then you have to hit like F12 for it to register that you want mouse control on it. Uh, it does, I believe it says that in the uh, readme file that comes with it if you get it from the hacking contest site. Not sure about if when it goes on the vault, it probably has all the documentation. But at least I've said it now, in case it doesn't. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. Throw us a like if you did. And I'll catch you on the next episode. Take care. Okay, thanks. Bye. Come on!